हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई निधि गुप्ता फ्रॉम बियानी ग्रुप ऑफ कॉलेजेस आईटी डिपार्टमेंट टुडे वी विल डिस्कस द टॉपिक डेटा स्ट्रक्चर एंड इट्स टाइप्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी शुड नो व्हाट इज डेटा डेटा आर द रॉ फैक्ट्स एंड फिगर्स व्हिच वी हैव इन कंप्यूटर व्हाटएवर वी हैव इन कंप्यूटर इज कॉल्ड डेटा एंड स्ट्रक्चर इज द वे ऑफ ऑर्गेनाइजिंग दैट डेटा तो बेसिकली डेटा स्ट्रक्चर इज अ वे ऑफ ऑर्गेनाइजिंग डेटा इन योर इन आवर कंप्यूटर सिस्टम and if we are, if i talk about uh, the bookish definition then logical and mathematical model of any data is called data structure and types of data structure they basically there are two types of data structure first is linear data structure and another one is non linear data structure as you have you already know about c c programming in c programming we already have used array array linear is data structure is the data structure in which we store data in linear fashion in the memory location data is stored in linear pattern that is called linear data structure basically four types of data structure we will discuss later that is array stack queue and linked list in non linear data structure data is arranged in non linear fashion in memory then it is called non linear data structure in this we will discuss the two types tree and graph now we will start with our linear data structure that is array and stack now what is array you already know about array array is a data array contains all the similar types of data in memory location we can store only similar type of data like we can store whether integer or all the character values it is represented in c like this you declare it and you mention the size here suppose the size of array is 5 then you will declare a 5 second data structure is stack in stack basically data is data can be deleted or inserted at only one end that is called top we can insert or delete data from the top of the stack suppose you are inserting a data like this a b c then it will come at the top of the stack if you have to delete then you can only delete the data which comes at the last you will delete c first then b then a we are inserting the data last will delete it first will be deleted first that is why it is called lifo last in first out the element which is inserted last will be deleted first that is this is called stack we can see the application of stack like if i arrange the plates in a in a container if i put the last plate at the top then i will remove that plate first when i have to uh, i have to blank that container now second third is queue third linear data structure is queue in queue insertion and deletion are performed at another end suppose you are inserting from here then a will come here then b then c then deletion will be performed at this end the inserting end is called rear and the deleting end is called front element will be inserted from here a b c then deletion will occur at the front end you will need to delete the a first and example of queue is the railway reservation system you can see when, when you apply for reservation the, the one who has applied first will get the ticket first that is the example or application of queue next linear data structure is linked list linked list is a data structure in which data is stored in the linear fashion but we can insert the data in middle and delete the data from middle very easily suppose the this is a linked list in in this link in the linked list each node has two fields first field contain the data and second field contain the address of next node and one header is also included header contains the address of first node suppose the address of this node is 12 and address of this node is 16 then and it will contain 12 and here will be the data a and it will contain the 16 and it will contain the second data and the last node of linked list contains the null we can know the last node is null if we have cross at last or at last we have null the, it will uh, symbolize that it is the last node this is all about linear data structure now we will go for non linear data structure in non linear data structure first of all we have tree 
3 basically the data is stored in non linear fashion as it is a non linear data structure so data is stored in the form of tree in an hierarchical order like this the application of tree is suppose you have to store a name of a person the name is divided into three fields first name last name and middle name in that case you can uh, you can use a tree data structure this is the non linear data structure and again another non linear data structure is graph graph is a non linear data structure the data is, is stored in non linear fashion but not in hierarchical model in graph in tree the data is stored in graphical hierarchical model but in graph data is not stored in graphical pattern the data is stored in this way we can say graph is a connected tree now what are the operation which we perform on data structure the operation we perform on data basic operation we perform on data structures are traversing in traversing the node is exactly read once if you read the each node exactly once that is called traversing each node will be visited once that is called traversing next is searching you need to need to search the particular node and next is insertion you want to add a new node or new data element to your data structure that is called insertion and last operation we will perform is deletion to delete any node from the data structure is called deletion you have, if you have to remove any data that is called deletion it is all about data structure its types and its operation thank you